Oh, you're back. Let's see what you found. This memo reads, Attention Cellbots. Cellbot Towers has installed a new security system to keep all tunes out. Tunes caught in Cellbot Towers will be detained for questioning. Please meet me in the lobby for appetizers to discuss. Signed, Mingler. Very interesting. I'll pass on this information immediately. Brings me back a third memo. The third of four. Off to get it. Yep, that's what I'm doing now. Alright, what does this memo say? Attention Cellbots, Tunes have somehow found a way to infiltrate Cellbot Towers. I'll call you tonight during dinner to give you the details. Signed, Telemarketer. I wonder how Tunes are breaking in. Please bring back one more memo and I think we'll have enough info for now. Alright, I knew you could do it. The last memo says, Attention Cellbots. I was having lunch with Mr. Hollywood yesterday. He reports that the VP is very busy these days. He will only be taking appointments from COGS that deserve a promotion. Forget to met forgot to mention Gladhander is golfing with me on Sunday. Signed Name Dropper. Well, Captain Amy, this has been very helpful. Here is your reward. Your laugh limit has been increased by three, up to forty now. Awesome. So, as we found out, this does make sense. The cell bots here. Um, the way to sneak into the cellbot HQ is to be dressed up like a cog. And if you get enough merit points and you're ready to be promoted up to another level of your type of cog, then you can get into the head VP and then attack and take it. And that's basically what we're going to probably be working on here very soon. I don't know when we get the access to work on collecting cog disguise parts and merits, but we will find out soon. So we're going to go back to the playground. Actually, um, let's see, are we close to... Yeah, we're very close to the HQ, so we'll just go to the HQ here, just in case we have to go back to the cell, cell bot place. There's a flunky. There's two flunkies. I wish I could get them. Yeah, they're not in Toontown, though. Unless they have to be anywhere, then you can teleport to me. Well, what level are they? Five, but I can fight them with you. Mm. Let me try. Can they be anywhere? One laugh point boost, one Oh yeah, they could be boost. anywhere, so I could teleport to you. Okay. Hang on one second. But then I'd be stuck over there, because then... You can't tell. You could always, you can teleport back to the goofy speedway. <laughs> That's true. And then walk from there. Sorry, I was going in and out. Oh, you're good. Oh, that one's flying away. Oh, I don't know how to go to Daisy's Gardens. Oh, you haven't walked there yet? No. Oh, you can't come here because you have to walk here first? Yeah. All you have to do is walk down that one road, but I don't see any right now. They, I saw one. Oh, oh wait, yeah, no, here's a here. flunky. Okay. Let me join the battle. Is that the last one you need? Mm-hmm. And of course now they're everywhere. There's a level 3 one here. Let me look up... Uh... Oh, cog invasion just began. Ambulance chasers don't care. I can't hold 80 jelly beans yet, I don't have teleportation access, I can't carry three tune tasks, and I don't have a gag pouch of 35, I don't think. Correct. So all of the important tasks from Daisy's Toontown haven't been offered yet, but I've got more, I've done two of the laugh point ones, Uncle Spud did that one. Let me see, one of these is just delivering things, and that's totally okay. I'll, I'll deliver I like the ones where you just have to deliver mm -hmm. um, gags to somebody. It's kind of like a way to prove that you've been leveling up and you're like on the third or the fourth gag to progress. Yeah, like this. Ten squirting flowers to Sophie Squirt. One laugh point boost. We'll do that. Oh, these changed already. My tasks. Alright, let's see. I need to go use some more gags before I can hold ten flowers, so... We'll go fight something first. Oh, 
Both of them came to me at once, dang. And that whole rule about they won't outnumber you, <laughs> I have been stuck in so many three versus one battles, it's not even funny. <laughs> Well, I think it was more like at the lower levels. They don't yeah, do I think definitely the higher you get, especially if there's a cog invasion, I've noticed they're like all over you. Yeah. Like this, I just got two right off the bat to fight me. Yeah, well, invasions are a little bit different because they're more aggressive, I guess. Yeah, but outside of it, I've also got it. Mm. I need to find some blue store. I will test that out and see. Yeah, we'll go to the store right here and see what happens. It's not a shop door. Knock knock. Who's there? Auto. Auto who? Auto no, but I've forgotten. As the door flashes, they said they fixed they fixed that glitch with like doors disappearing and stuff. Like mm -hmm. they helped work on the graphics. I have to say I didn't really have that problem before. I have that problem everywhere I go now. <laughs> Things are flashing mm -hmm. left and right, and it's kind of terrible. That's been happening to me since I downloaded this game. So. Oh, okay. I mean, I, I noticed it like a little bit, but now it's like every time I walk up to a door, it's like blah, 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 craziness. I'm like, oh my gosh. I hate how some places it's so hard to find like things for health and other times you find them like some regions are like Donald's docks it's really easy to heal up and spawn and in this place it's really difficult Ten, I don't know why they want 10 squirting flowers are like I've already proved I can use squirting flowers but I bet you it'll lead to something else. So I'll just go ahead and take those. Was it on? Maple Street, the squirting flower. Okay. <laughs> From start to spinach. Cynthia's camera shot. Cynthia, he's a really good dancer. Cynthia, he's a really good dancer. What? Remember that from the Rugrats? Tough God Jim. You gotta look when you get it on the first cog you can feel it. I don't know what you're looking for. Take it or leave it. Oh, there's a squirting flower. It's like the only building not taken over on the street. It might be because it's a quest building. I'm not sure. No, I my quest building was taken over. That's why I had to teleport around a couple times. Come back to me after you defeated 20 cogs! Yep, 10, okay, after the 20 cogs, then I get my one laugh boost. Lame. It has to be on Maple Street. Well, looks like I'll be doing invasions here for a while. Yeah, might as well do an invasion. 
There's an invasion here. Let me see if there is spin doctors. And with that, I now have a brand new drop gag coming our way. We'll see what it is. It's the anvil? No, probably not the anvil. I think there's something else before. The sack. Yes, a new drop gag. There we go. The sack. Alright. Now, the way I was doing that is... In the invasion, I was attacking the Lawbots first. Like, I was attacking them and doing damage to them first. And then, like, to finish them off, I was doing the other drop, the drop guy, and it seemed to be hitting a higher chance then. And then... In addition, it seemed to... That I was also using that... Dang. The, the boost that you get an accuracy that when, if you have multiple people in a row and they're fighting one bot, and they like the bot gets hit by like a cake, and then you use the drop gag, it has a much higher increased chance of hitting. It's like an accuracy bonus. And I was fighting a couple with people and I got like like three hits on it because I hit a, a cog after somebody else had hit it. Um, so it actually worked pretty well, that method, um, and helped a lot with, with doing that, with getting that drop up. And I'm gonna use that method when I'm training from now on, I'm going to focus on, you know, finding someone else to training in groups, higher level COG invasions where people aren't really killing them. I can kind of, but they're doing damage to them and then I can, you know, take them off that way. So. because I gotta get, I might as well use up these flower pots because I'm not gonna use them anymore ever because it's so silly too. So silly too. How much do I have dropped now, by the way? How many do I have to do? A hundred. Okay, it's not 50. So it's not super easy, but it is there. Oh, they're fighting this one. I guess this will be my last one, then I gotta go back to the base. Or maybe I'll just finish off all 20 on this road. Let's see. What am I going to do? Well, I guess I'll do Squirt 2 then. Because they're going to probably kill it with those two. Oh, we got another one. Let's see what's everyone going to do. High, then I'll do the drop because that won't kill it and eh, that might kill it that will kill it I know for a fact dang it couldn't hit back so this is I want to do drop. I agree. I want to use this last drop up. Oh wow! Boom boom! Oh boom! The guy that was that was training with a little bit, he was dropping his safe on them. It did 66 damage. It's crazy.
Where's it? Oh, defeated the 20. Cool. We'll go back and find that place. I need to go help this person as soon as this is done doing it all for everyone. I don't know where that person went. Maybe they died. Alright, I think, what was the place called? Oh yeah, the squirting flower. There we go. This is just my last point, and hopefully we'll get something interesting now from HQ. Cool. My reward was not only an increased life limit of one, but also a new drop gag. So that's why I see that they're giving us a lot of these get laugh points. One, because you need a higher health, and two, because it make, usually spends time that you're grinding. And you're going to need... Wait, where's the place? You're going to need that extra health points and extra grinding levels to get those better gags for when you do have to go into the HQ because I think we're going to do stuff at this HQ kind of before I leave this area. So that's kind of why this is just sort of, you know, nothing too exciting. All right. Well, hopefully we get at least, you know, an expansion pack here. Or the Oh yeah, we'll take the small bag. I want my extra five. Help investigate some stuff at the headquarters. Sounds like a plan. We're gonna go back to the playground real quick though. Check out that new gag at the gag shop and then I think I'm gonna call it quits for a bit. actually a line here. This is 18, which is pretty good. Skill credit four right now, which is only two. Oh, we can only take, oh, we can only take five. Ah, dang. I thought it was gonna be like this one because it gave you 10 from the start, but it only gives us five. That's unfortunate. I guess I should take a couple of these. Sure. I also do want to go plant this at home, but I'll go ahead and do that myself. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later on more Toontown Rewritten. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching. If you'd like to check out some more Minecraft, why not check out my Sky Factory 2 Let's Play with Zerthig and Necker by clicking here in the top left. If you'd like to see something else, you can check out my Eidolon Let's Play that I'll be finishing this summer by clicking here in the top right. You can follow me on Twitter down below, and then if you would like what you've seen so far and you have yet to subscribe, click the big banner below.